said, make some noise, Chicago, Illinois. If you have rap music, I want to appreciate you right now. Our government has a firm policy not to capitulate to terrorist demands, that no concessions policy remains in force. In spite of the wildly speculative and false stories about arms for hostages and alleged ransom payments, we did not, repeat, did not trade weapons or anything else for hostages, nor will we. The ballot or the bullet, some freedom or some bullshit. Will we ever do it big? The test you set to let for look shit. We brag on having bread, but none of us are acres. We all talk having grains, but none of us on acres. If none of us on acres, if none of us go weak, then who will beat our people when our people need to? So it seems our people saw from lack of understanding. And all we seem to give up is some ball and some dance. And some talking about our car and imaginary mansions. We should be indicted for bullshit we excited. Selling children death and pretending it's exciting. We are advertisement for agony and pain. We exploit the youth, we tell them to join the gang. We tell them dope stories, introduce them to the gang. The cycle of a north introduced us to cocaine. In the 80s when the bricks came on military plane. I said, fuck Ronald Reagan. Two months ago, I told the American people I did not trade arms for hostages. That was a lie. My heart and my best intentions still tell me that's true, but the facts and the evidence and tell me And that was a goddamn lie. The end of the Reagan era, I'm like level 12 up. Old enough to understand that shit ain't changed us. They declare a war on drugs, like a war on terror, when it really did was that the police terrorized whoever. But mostly black boys, but they would call us niggas and lay us on our feet and while their fingers on their triggers, their boots was on our head, their dogs was on our watches, and they would beat us up if we had diamonds on our watches, and they would they got drugs and money that they pick up. I guess that that's the privilege of police and muscle profit. But thanks to Reaganomics, prison turned to profit. Cause free labor's the cornerstone of US economics. Cause slavery was abolished, unless you are in prison. You think I am a shit, and then read the 13th Amendment. And voluntary servitude and slavery in prohibited. That's why they give it drug offenders time and double. Ronald Reagan was an actor, not at all a factor. Just that employee of the country's real master. Just like the Bushes. Clinton and Obama, just another talking, telling lies on teleprompter. If you don't believe I hear it, then are you with this lie? Why did Reagan and Obama both go after Gaddafi? We invaded sovereign soil, going at the oil, taking countries as a hobby, paid for by the whole lot. Saving in our wrath, and I can't stay. And I'm a dinner judge, and they coming for our way. They only know the rich, and how they know the poor. If I say any more, they might be at my door. Shh, who the fuck is that? Staring in my window, doing that surveillance on Mr. Michael Rinder. I'm dropping out the grid before they pump the lid. I leave you with four words. I'm glad Reagan. I leave you with four words. I leave you with four words. I leave you with four words. We leave you with four words.